As I sit here, day of the wedding, all I can think about is how much my life has changed since going to the bar five years ago. Dear Sam, five years ago today, I met the girl at a bar. <laughs> Sorry, we started the same exact way. At night we spoke for hours, but the only thing that's been on my mind is my five-year plan. I told you how I was going to live in a city by myself, because I don't need a man. Here I am, five years later, about to walk down the aisle to the love of my life. She was cool, but even though we hit it off that night, if you had asked me then if I would be marrying anyone in the next five years, I would have said that that's inconceivable. Then the next five years happened. I got to know you. We started dating. You met my entire family at the same time. And I met yours. We fell in love. Well, I was right. I don't need a man. I want a man. I want you and I choose you. I want to spend the rest of my life dancing in the kitchen with you until our blackened salmon gets a little too blackened. You help turn my crazy dreams into reality, make me feel safe when I'm scared, and stand by my side no matter what. You were the best partner I could have imagined, and I cannot wait to see you at the end of that aisle. What once was inconceivable has happened. You have shown me that you're my soulmate, and the soulmate can actually be a thing. I may not know what's in store for us in the next five years, in our lifetime. But with you by my side, I know it's gonna be filled with love and adventure. I love you more than I ever thought possible. Now let's get married. The future, Samantha and Weeks. What true love can be. <laughs> and I will love you now and forever because of it. Love, Ethan. Should I read it again and try not to cry? <laughs>